Today, we finally make some progress. Cutting. And I promise we're keeping this very, very simple. So step one, pick where you want to edit. So down here, you'll see cut and edit. Cut page is faster and simpler. Edit page is more flexible. And it's what I use because I've never used a cut page. I should learn how to do it. Step two, get your first clip on the timeline. In your footage bin, grab your first clip. Drag it down into the timeline. Now you have video. Press space bar to play and stop. Step three, the two cuts you need, cut out the bad parts. Here's the goal, remove the boring stuff. There are two easy ways. The first way is the blade tool. Press B for blade, click where you want to cut out, click again where the bad part ends. Press A to go back to normal selects. Click the part that you want to remove and delete. Now, you'll probably see a gap. To close the gap, right click the gap, delete gap or just highlight the gap and hit backspace or delete, depending on your setup, be it Mac or PC. The second way, you can trim the ends. It's probably even faster. Hover near the start or end of a clip until you see the trim icon. Click and drag to shorten it. That's it, that's trimming. Now, you see this little magnet icon that's snapping. Turn it on. Now the clips stick together and don't leave tiny gaps. Beginners should keep snapping on like 90% of the time. Now, step five, add your second clip. Now, drag your next clip to the end of the first clip with snapping on. It should line up nicely. Now, repeat. Cut out the boring parts, the bad parts, the parts that you don't want to include it in the video. Close the gap. Keep the pace moving. Let me give you some shortcuts that will speed your process up. The space bar is to play or stop. B is for blade. A is for select. Control command S saves your file. That's all you need today. So your homework is simple this time. Make a 15 to 30 second video. Use the blade at least five times. Remove dead space and whatever you don't want and close all the gaps. Save the project. Now, if you found this video helpful, I'll show you how to trim faster without constantly blading everything in the next video. See you.